The vaccine uses a novel backbone uh, technology where we have a rabies virus that we, we insert the MERS spike protein to. So now on that vaccine, we now have the MERS, the MERS spike protein, but also the rabies G protein. So if you use this vaccine in animals, you get double protection, both for rabies and for MERS. Ideally, what we want to do is get into people. Uh, we think that the first step would be putting it into camels in the Middle East, which sounds kind of strange, but the reason is because camels are the reservoir for the MERS virus, and the virus seems to jump from camels into people to infect people. And so if we can vaccinate camels when they're born, then they can never be infected, which then will block that initial transmission from camels to humans. So we're very hopeful that this will be able to get the next steps in this process. So first, we're trying to make the vaccine better already by changing the um, antigen a bit and, and changing the construct. But the, what we really want to do is now make connections with the Middle Eastern countries, including Saudi Arabia, where most of the MERS cases are, so that we can now get this into camels and do testing in animals to really prove that we are getting the effective protection that we think we are.